Whatever YouTube, knowledge of self-determination. So, I um, wanted to update you guys. I was watching um, a video by the uh, Advice Show, and they were updating, uh, doing an update on um, a situation that uh, that is that is kind of uh, linked to. In fact, it is directly linked to the Jacqueline, the Jacqueline Craig case. Some of you guys may remember Jacqueline Craig. Um, she was uh, the woman who was um, assaulted by a white supremacist cop after she called the cops because her neighbor had choked her son because he allegedly threw a piece of paper on the ground um excuse me and she and two of her daughters were arrested as a result of their complaint to the police and now we find that the and uh i think it was maybe a week or so later a couple of days later the, it was it was a little while after the incident the chest cam video was released on the internet now we're hearing that it was two black officers that actually leaked the chest cam video right now these two officers they were chiefs they have been demoted right demoted now remember the officer that had assaulted Jacqueline Craig and her daughters right now mind you all the charges have been dropped against Jacqueline Craig and her daughters right but I'll get to that in a minute. Now, that officer was suspended for 10 days with pay. And basically told he had to make amends with the people in the community, basically. That that was his punishment. That's it. No demotion, no citation. You know what I'm saying? Nothing. These two chiefs combined have put in over, what, close to 40 years with that police department. And they were demoted for actually putting the truth out there when it was the departments and the heads of that department's responsibility to let that footage be put out there so the public could see what actually happened. Yes, it was their job to do that. And they didn't do that. They didn't do that. So, help me understand exactly how is any of this justice right how is this justice now these two cops have received a harsher punishment for actually serving true justice than this cop who was serving white supremacy do you guys understand what is being implicated here and phil also said something about the um uh, what was it called? Blue laws? Or something to that effect. Basically where cops are going to be able to basically police the public, the communities, with impunity. No charges. No, basically, they can do whatever they want and nothing negative is going to happen to them or come their way, basically. An authoritarian state. Totalitarian rule. And a police state. Authoritarian tactics in a totalitarian state with police tactics, you know, pol I, man, I mean, what more do you people need to see that white supremacy is a cancer to this world, because there's only white supremacy that's doing these things, I'm not even making it a black or white thing right now, because I'm telling you right now, if they are able to pass laws that will give cops total immunity, they will be able to act with impunity, total anonymity, for the most part. They can do whatever they want to you and not be punished for it. If you're not a rich or wealthy person, your ass is grass. At that point, color doesn't even make a fucking difference. Because I'm going to tell you something. You, you, you low income having white people. Rich white people don't give a fuck about you. They could care less about you. And I'm going to tell y'all something too, man. Because a lot of you dumb motherfuckers out here, racist white supremacists, you know what I mean, $15,000 a year making white motherfuckers and shit, you ain't doing better than a lot of other people. You feel me? You're not doing better than a lot of people. You poor just like a lot of other motherfuckers, but got the nerve to hate other motherfuckers. You understand what I'm saying? Now listen, you people don't even realize it, but I'm going to tell you. 
Racism is a fucking illusion. It was created by the people with power to constantly have people without power constantly at each other's throats. And you people don't even fucking realize it.